beach right now. People there are preparing for Michael as it is now coming straight for the Carolinas. NBC Charlotte's Xavier Walton live in Myrtle Beach for us tonight. Xavier, the last time we spoke, you described choppy conditions, but you said it wasn't stopping the people from enjoying the beach. Fred, and that's why I was a bit scared to watch children out there in that current, in the choppy water. But just a minute ago, we got hit with a pretty heavy band of rain. It moved on. We got hit with some pretty strong wind gusts as well. But people here at Myrtle Beach are trying to, to prepare for what Hurricane Michael may bring their way. This is one example, just clearing out a little storm drain here. But here's a look at, at that choppy water that we were talking about. We spoke to several fishermen that were out here today, several beachgoers. They said they noticed the water was definitely choppy and it was picking up. The current was getting stronger. And then we saw kids out there and that that's where we were a bit concerned. One thing that they did mention with the choppiness and how strong it was, they didn't notice that it shifted in directions. Now here at North Myrtle, this is one of those places that is under that tropical storm warning. So obviously people here are worried about the high wind, uh, the potential for flooding, as well as the potential for tornadoes. Now driving in, we did see several businesses with boards, not quite up yet, but it looked like they were sort of preparing for what hurricane uh, Michael could bring this way starting later tonight and into tomorrow. Reporting live, though, in Myrtle Beach, Xavier Walton, back to you guys. Xavier, thanks.